Hello, this is the Saturday Wrap for Saturday the 3rd of June 2023. Your actual summer, and boy is it a summer. It's a drought, there's no rain at least until the middle of the month. That saith the Met Office. My arm is hanging off due to the watering canness of it all. Which is, of course, no fun. Anyway, if you haven't seen this before, this is the Saturday Wrap. The Saturday Wrap for Saturday the 3rd of June 2023. Actually, recorded the day before. Um, Friday the 2nd. So look back on where I went. The tech I used. Things that happened to me. Dancing. Drugs. And why this is the second recording. Something to do with microphones, no doubt. Anyway. Let's look back on the week, starting with the word or phrase of the week. Friday afternoon emails. Possibly to do with the fact that they would be very interesting to a lot of people and um, you just wanted to dribble them out and not bring down the server farm. Something to do with, and I can see this in the papers tomorrow, civil servants pay, I believe. I'll say no more than that, but it seems to be good news for me because, well, Times are hard, and I have to pay for bigger watering cans and all that water, because I'm on a water meter, to water my potatoes. Well, that's what I believe anyway. Um, the app of the week. So, MB06, um, last, well, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, back on the Monday. Uh, yeah, lots of moving things around and going to folders and all that, and then having to tree navigate. I had a copy of... I actually had a license for it as well. Default Folder X, which allows you from either the Finder, the Mac equivalent of Windows File Manager, or the Open and Close dialogs just to jump to folders. So I'm back online. Updated version. Put my old license number in there. Cheap upgrade. I've got it back. I believe, and I did have a long time ago, a version of something similar on Windows. I might actually get it back. I need to have a look at that. Anyway. Default folder X if you're on the Mac. Really works. Really does. Thing of the week. Thing of the week is antibiotics. Okay, so how did I get antibiotics? Why am I wearing glasses? Why am I a bit nasally? Well, going back the week before last, if you remember, I went to the doctor with my infected year. He gave me a year spray. Well, actually two lots, just in case the first one ran out. And then he said, if this doesn't work after a week, well, normally he would say something like, come back and see me. But he said, I'll give you a script for some antibiotics and you can take those. Come back to that later. But I think this is, uh, right, um, you seem like you know what you're doing. I don't need to see you again um, and just get on with it. Saves time, saves money for us all. And I think it's a lot better. But there we go. I will explain the issues, as I've said. Um, let's look at the week before. Saturday, MB06. Um, started out in the Premier Inn. Beef eater, full English breakfast. Um, pictures, videos, uploaded to Reddit, r slash fry ups, typical social media. Uh, can't see the beans. They're there next to the tomato. Put the tomato is raw, because I like raw tomatoes in the title. You got a raw tomato there, mate. Um, the bacon is minging. The bacon looks great. Um, how much is too much bacon when it's all you can eat? Can you go back four times? Typical social media. Really good for my stats. Really, really good. Reposted one on Sunday so you could see all the different bits. Yeah, people were less keen to post. But there you go. Also, um, started out in the Lord High Constable after my breakfast. Lord High Constable of England, the spoons in the do uh, Gloucester Keys, then onto the Regal, another spoons, and then onto the Chippy, which is an old thatched wattle building, um, and it won some award for a chip shop in 2010. Three quid for a little tray. Um, chips weren't that good either, and if you put lots of vinegar on, they come through the bottom of the tray. <coughs> Cough. I'll come back to the cough as well. Um, but still, I needed chips. Uh, and then straight on to the pelican. Pelican. Filled rolls on a Saturday and Sunday. On this Saturday, Morris men. Morris men dancing and banging sticks at one o'clock. 
I really liked it. I have to be honest. Oh, ooh. yeah. Um, come back to the cold as well. Um, it was good. It was interesting. It was sunny. It was very English. And um, I had a beer. I had a beer from Wiper and True. <coughs> yeah. Um, Wiper and True at a Bristol, uh, Bristol brewery. It was their 10th birthday. It was a collab. I really liked it. Pasted it all over the place. Social media plus. Sunday morning, woke up on my Facebook. Happy birthday, Roger. Happy birthday, Roger. Roger, happy birthday. Put on a number of them. It's not actually my birthday. It's my friend True's 10th birthday. Still got happy birthday, Roger. Thank you to all those people who wish me a happy birthday. But it was Wiper and True. And they are a really good brewery. And uh, also on Sunday, um, is that a cold I feel developing? The answer is, yes, it is. It is definitely a cold. Um ended up again in the pelican more wiper and true birthday beers including a coconut stout which was exceptional i really like the um the pelican and i saw pelican t-shirts i need to ask uh, uh, mike about those um we had a long discussion on the friday about welsh people and big ears um it's a long story and it's my own fault to be perfectly honest um a monday my last day um straight in the beef eater for seven o'clock to have my full english then leave no full english a uh, very nice lady explained to me that the chef hadn't turned in and they were still working out how to turn everything on and it would be at least 40 minutes and i needed to get away because it was a bank holiday monday and i could leave early uh even with that the roads were rather busy um i tweeted at premier in saying bit disappointed couldn't get my full english i did however have the continental part lots of toast cran reduce coffee uh, a yogurt muesli etc long story short tldr too long didn't read after a couple of days premier in refunded the whole lot not just the difference between a continental and a full english i like the premier in they tend to be customer orientated in fact they are very customer orientated uh, i'm back there sunday and they tuesday as well um wwdc amongst other things anyway came home on monday had a look at what micro dot blog my micro blogging platform was doing with twitter they used to cross post and they used to cross post all the pictures now because of apa changes and costs just one link and that's only to one photo yeah so i stopped cross posting from micro dot blog i'm gonna to have to post directly from the twitter app itself which is bleh. but what can you do and yeah put the washing machine on all my clothes and i took them out and it was all white stuff all over the place turns out i'd washed a full toilet roll i'm not quite sure i mind you it was behind the um the bath where i keep the toilet rolls as well and i must have picked it up by mistake and not noticed and i'm still trying to get bits of toilet roll out to close having rewashed them again and having washed them and all that sort of, oh god i felt really like Rrr! you know tuesday definitely a cold back to work definitely a cold kept my glasses on um been wearing contacts up until then oh yeah well what can you do oh yeah um wednesday still cold nose running like a tap uh um bought default folder x really easy put the code in got a cheap version of it it's in business thank you also wednesday night came home planted more lettuce uh cut and come again leaves and such like three weeks since the last lot went in which is coming along nicely but slightly slow to be honest um ordered some more um oh no that was monday ordered some more tomato seeds and pepper seeds because none of those have come through and they were sent out on wednesday and they still haven't arrived yet so um i'm going to be planting tomorrow i can see this now um also on wednesday paying for a bench i'll come back to that maybe um thursday okay so doctor said um if your ears are still a little bit infected or you um stop using the spray go on to the antibiotics well it was a lot better but they were still a little bit so i started the antibiotics and i have a cold at the same time now antibiotics 
won't touch your cold because colds are viral and antibiotics just do for bacterial uh, anyway what tends to happen is my cold goes down and my chest it gets infected i spend the next three weeks coughing i'm thinking because it did go down on my chest slightly but today it's a lot better uh, having the antibiotics at the same time is protecting me a little bit about them against them maybe maybe it's psychosomatic who knows uh, but my year is definitely improving um i'm gonna finish the full course as well friday today sunny uh um more washing um more watering canning um emails and work you know and a big gammon 10 ounce gammon in spoons for lunch with the acorn and tie oh mm. could have stayed there to be perfectly honest anyway how are we looking oh we've gone over 10 minutes doesn't really matter um what we got ahead 85th birthday tomorrow that's my father mbo7 on sunday back to gloucester three nights there wwdc on monday tuesday won't be back in the pelican again mind you sunday and uh, whatever monday um uh, wednesday come back thursday virtual conference from work friday we start all over again met office says no rain until mid june oh my anyway that was me comments as per usual bye bye